Hello, I'm Terence. I'm here recording with Family Church for the uh, Celebration Project recording. I'm going to show you a few touches that I've made on the set to make it more comfortable, make it more visual for the people who are coming. First of all, I've put up the psalms that we're singing today. This is Psalm 141, Come One, Come All, and Psalm 368, Victory Horns. Now, I know you probably think these aren't in the Bible, but we've added them today. Um, okay. Come one, come all. Um, yeah, as we were as we were looking at writing this song and and just sort of capturing like what we felt was sort of the I guess the heartbeat behind it. Mopeds. So uh, what's all this about? Well, this is the uh, this is a celebration project, mate. We're recording a bunch of different instruments for a couple of worship songs we've written. It's exciting times, exciting stuff. Looking forward to mixing it down. Big day of recording today. Capturing it all in one day. It's yeah. on some kind of world record, I'm sure. Yeah, it seems to be a lot of instruments here. You've got guitar, drums, bass guitar. I hear you've even got um, some brass instruments coming up. Oh yeah, the most exciting bit. Yeah, definitely. Uh, we've got an orchestra coming in a little bit later um, to lay down some, some beautiful trumpet parts, some, some saxophone parts, um, even some flute. So yeah, that's, that's really exciting, really exciting. There's no cameras in the Bible, so you know, don't expect it here. About to do a vocal take in the corner over here. This is the, one of the oldest parts of the building, and this church, they reckon, is a thousand years old. It's the oldest building in the whole of Guildford, and we are standing in one of the oldest parts, and I think that's pretty cool. Hey Terry, can you talk to us a little bit about what you're doing here today? Today, mm. we're recording. <laughs> Any more info than that? You want to we're recording some sweet music, some awesome people for God. So um, it's a pretty good day. It's pretty uh, pretty enjoyable. <laughs> I'm gonna let it shine. I'm the drummer's driver and I make sure all his equipment gets to the church and back again safely. That's my role. I just really believe that um, this, uh, this whole project um, is just uh, a celebration for everything that God has done for me personally, for everything that God's done for, for everyone involved. Um, and uh, it's, it's just about enjoying the gifts that God's given uh, us and, and just getting creative with, uh, with the art form itself. So what's the big plan? I mean, after this recording's finished, after the celebration project is finished and all the recordings are done, you know, what are you going to move on to next? What's the big plan? <laughs> Hopefully you just kind of scale it up a bit, you know, like yeah, take man. it to a bigger scale. Um, it'd be really great to sort of Maybe in involve wider family church, you know, yeah. more, more congregations, just get, get everyone who, who, yeah. who has a passion for music involved. Maybe next time you could hire out a fire station. Yeah, yeah, that would be a great venue. Um, a great venue, yeah, Load, loads, loads of stuff at our disposal with that, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's a good idea, thank you. You're gonna, you're gonna be there? To I'm there, us? Oh, I'm there, let me know. Lovely. <laughs> I bought some coffee. Yeah. You lift it up a bit higher, please. So uh, what's your last word to the people watching? What do you want to say? Oh, really, my last word's just, you know, enjoy it. I hope it sounds as good as it does here. Hope it looks as good as it has done for us. We've had an incredible time. Uh, I'm still enjoying it. Um, yeah, so just hope, hope that it's, um, it's, 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 it comes out well, really. Yeah. Luke 14, Jesus talks about this incredible banquet that takes place. It's a parable of the great banquet. And in this great banquet, the king sends invites to people to come to, to, to celebrate with it. And you get this scenario where a lot of people that are invited don't come, but then he sends out another invite. And I love this. He sends it out to the sick, the poor, the lame, 
the people out on the streets that wouldn't normally come to something like this. He sends invites to them and, and they come, but a house still isn't full. So the king then says to his servants, go out into the highways and the byways and compel people to come. And in my imagery, you get this incredible party, this incredible celebration of people coming from a whole load of different backgrounds with a whole load of different issues, and yet they're able to celebrate with the king. And I believe that that is an imagery of the kingdom of God. That's the imagery of praise, where people come from all different walks of life, with all different issues, and celebrate in the presence of the king. And that's really where the power of praise takes place. Praise is where we celebrate the promise, not the present. And this is about celebrating the promise and all that God's going to bring through them. And it's with this um, situation, with these thoughts, that Tom and the crew went and began to write, Come One, Come All. So guys, enjoy. Come One, Come All. Come One, Come All.